Hey, this is Ancient Oak Films coming at you with another review on the Lego Star Wars Clone Walker Battle Pack. It has 72 pieces, ages 6 to 14, and its number is 8014. Okay, here's the back of the box. Nice and shiny boxes. Making really nice boxes these days. Um, let's start off with the minifigs. First, we have the new Clone Gunner, which is really, really nicely detailed and colored. It's really nice. Comes with just a regular gun. Two regular Clone Troopers, one right here, and one right here. Both come with just regular guns. That was my cat. And then it comes with a another clone with black commando gear. With two black pistols. Commando pistols. And I don't like using all the special armor and stuff. Because I already have enough commanders with Cody and Rex. I just put this on for the review. It also comes with a bunch of headgear and stuff. But I couldn't find it. Um, and I usually just put one of these regular guns on it, so I can have more just regular clones. Um, and on the new clones' heads, they have an actual face, unlike the old ones, which just had a black stud of a head. Um, their faces are really nice, their helmets are really nice, um... But the old ones, the shock trooper heads were kind of cool. So I kind of miss the shock troopers. The, um, the only set you can get them in anymore is the ATRT. And now with the bat, now with the walker, um, it has two flick fire missiles. And it falls down because I did not attach it on correctly. See? Way over here. Now, it's really surprising to me that these um, flick fire missiles go so far, go the length, distance that they do, since they don't have any springs or anything to propel them. But that, that's just really nice, I think. And um, there is a Republic sign gun in front. There's supposed to be a long well, um, nozzle, but I took it off. I think it looks cooler. Pro I don't know if you do. Probably not. Um, there are also these seats, two s room for two people. And, um, what's nice about these things right here is that if you had made a large hanger area, you could have little clips that you could just clip these on and you could have them hanging by the ceiling. So that that's nice. Um... Lego wasn't very creative with this set. I mean, in the last ones, they had a really nice speeder bike and a gun turret. This one, they only had a little walker. Um, so I'd give it a um, 4 out of 5. You know, it would have been nice to for them to put, like, a um, turret or something. Ha make it a little bit more unique instead of just a battle pack. Um, but I think it's a really nice set nonetheless, and, um, it's essential for any, um, Lego collector, Star Wars Lego collector to have. Um, well, this, this is, um, that's all, folks. Um, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, well, see ya. Oh, and, um, I'm going to be coming out with a lot more reviews. I have the, um, Republic Cruiser, Hyena Droid Bomber, Spider Droid, um, Hailfire Droid, and um, Crab Droid, or what you, whatever you call it. And then um, this summer, I am going to be getting some a lot more sets. I'm just saving up right now. So, again, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye.